Okay, so today we are answering the question of what size glove should we be using at shortstop, second base? I'll talk a little bit about third, but mainly infield and slow pitch softball. The way we're gonna be doing it is actually by going in game and talking about the gloves while I'm using them. This is sort of a new series that I've been doing. I've already done it with a Wilson Super Skin, kind of done an in-game glove review, and we'll be doing it in the future too. If that interests you, go ahead and subscribe. We're gonna be starting off with my JP11 from 44. This glove is 12 inches, therefore it's gonna be our smallest of the day. This has paisley leather all over the back, and you'll notice the hinge cross web, which I actually love. Then we're gonna bump it up one more size and go 12 and a quarter. This is my normal Pro 44 model with dual welting on it. This is sort of my America themed glove and I absolutely love this thing. The dual welting on this really does give it a lot more durability. One more size up and we got our Rawlings Heart of the Hide Pro 208-6. This is actually my current gamer and it's at 12 and a half and I absolutely love this model. Then we're gonna be finishing it off with the Wilson A2K Super Skin. This glove is 1275, and it's currently one of the biggest gloves I own. So far it's worked great, and the question is, is 1275 too big for softball? I will meet you guys at the field. The question of the day is, what size glove should you be using? Specifically, I'm gonna tell you for slow pitch softball, but I'll also talk a little bit about baseball. I believe this was a guy that was the umpire for the game where William did a check swing strike. He's like, I've been doing this for like 15 years and I've never seen somebody do that. <laughs> Marty. It is a little gross, but they're brand new batting gloves. I need to like, well, I've used them once. I need to get them broken. No, my 44 ones ripped. At first they ripped and then I was mad and um, they don't exist anymore. Well, I've been hitting horrible and I haven't gotten into the cage since then. So I've been on a cold streak. I'm sorry, everyone. So, are you allowed to quit mid-season? I've been really bad lately. Like, I'm very disappointed in myself because it's been very bad. Do you have any tips for me, Josh? All right, heading out to the field, 12 inches. Let's go. Okay, this glove sinks. Ugh, I just gotta forget about that at bat because that was horrible. Starting off with 12 inches, I gotta get my glove dirty today. Uh. feels okay. I'm gonna be bumping it up. Every time I get a play, I'm going one up in size. Nice play, Justin. Peep the buckler. You guys have seen the buckler in a video before, so it gets the job done. William, no! I'd rather, I'd rather Justin lay out for that ball than William settle under it. Hey William, we still like, we like you a little bit. Hey, we got a four set too. I'll be there if it's hit to you, Jordan. Ugh. All right, with that 12 inches, I was just thinking, get dirty, get dirty. So 12 inches felt short, even on that play. Just making a simple scoop felt short. Flips are obviously gonna be really easy, but honestly, it's still easy to make a glove flip with a bigger glove anyway, because the softball's just so big. So there's honestly no reason to use a glove this small. All right, this inning we're going out there with 12 and a quarter. This is my last year's gamer. It's been like, wow. It's been like two weeks or something like that. Let's go. I'm back, boss. I'm back, boss. I'm back, boss. All right, this guy's, uh, this guy's actually decent. All right, this guy's, uh, this guy's actually decent. My phone came out of my pocket. That's never happened before. Wait, hang on, Justin. <laughs> I do like this size. 12 and a quarter feels really nice. It feels really fast. Ah. I'm at two. That was three? Oh yeah, you had an out. 
I may not have been paying attention. All right, well, hey, 12 and a quarter. So far it goes down as my favorite size out of the ones we've done, which is only two. <laughs> 12 and a quarter is my favorite so far. I like this size. It seems kind of like perfect to me. It could use just a slight more amount of length, but everything just feels so fast when it comes to transfers, flips, anything. Even just moving my, my glove back to forth, this feels the best. So, so far it's in the lead. All right, 12 and a half, let's go. Moving on up. I just feel so lazy in this kind of heat. It's not even like that hot out. I'm just lazy. He got it. Thank you, Anthony. Well, didn't get any. It's a little unfair. Oh, did Jake put one out? Did he put one out? Oh! Jake, go back! What a choke artist! Go, Jonah, down the way. Go. It's hard to be that bad at softball. I think it is on Yeah, I'll get it for you. Yeah. Alright, didn't get any last inning, so same glove, new inning. Let's go. I got it. Just in case you were tagging. Hey, he went your way. Just play middle. Just play up the middle. Everybody, go up the middle. Everybody, no, play, everybody say it, play center field. Get back on it. Get back on it. Get back on it. Thank you, Callum. Yeah, I didn't say, these balls are just soft. That, that, off the bat, I'm like, oh, home run. Well, I kind of caught a ball. Not a ground ball. Yeah, I didn't say, I'm probably going to use it again because all I got was a little pop-up, and so I need to do another one. Does it not look super blurry or no? I can't tell. Okay, then never mind. You're not even looking. Good eye. I wasn't. You caught me. I wasn't looking. Meh. Am I allowed to bet righty? Because it's been really bad. Bigger leg kick? Maybe I'll go for the walk nowadays. There's no hope. All right, boys, let's go. I just like, I need to make a decent play. Otherwise, mentally, gonzo. I should have ran more. It was, it was just hit so slow. I was like, Argh. all right, let's go. I need a ground ball. Hey, good luck though, Jordan. Head away. You know what went through my head for a second? The behind the back glove flip. Thank you, Jordan. All right, well, there's a couple ground balls. I mean, 12 and a half. When it comes to just picking up a ball off the ground, it's much easier. It feels much better. Go cameraman. So 12 and a half was easily like the most clean feeling ball when it comes to just picking up ground balls. It does feel just slightly, slightly slower, obviously, from it being bigger. The Rawlings I have also is a lot softer. And so I don't know, the 44 just felt so much quicker back and forth, but like in the end, I think I'm probably gonna have a better fielding percentage with this club. Wait, what is that? And I just noticed that you haven't liked the video yet. So if you don't mind, go ahead and just like it really quick. It does actually seriously help me out in all honesty with the whole YouTube algorithm thing. And then if you didn't know this, we actually have merch. And so feel free, check it out. First link in the description, it supports the channel. Love you guys. Thank you. Yes, yeah, so using 1275. Definitely the biggest. So this is what we used uh, actually in like my last video or one of my last videos. Again, this glove's a little bit on the softer sides. I don't like that, but it is a nice glove. I used it in that video, but we'll be using it here again. Chris on deck. Uh, I'm in the hole. Dude, get your baseball terminology down. I better get a ground ball with this. If not, I'm just going to pull one out of last, oh. <laughs> last video. All right, 1275. Last glove of the day. Also last ending of the day. So we better get a, better get a ground ball. I got it. I wouldn't have caught that with a smaller glove. Just kidding. Wow, I dedicated that catch to this glove. Well, it's not a ground ball, but I got a ball. I wish I, I, wish I wasn't shifted as much and I could have made it a diving play. Oh, let's go! Oh, let's go! Woo! Hey, I love you so much. Don't get him out. Oh, nice play, Justin. I think I would have called you safe if I'm being honest. Good game.
All right, so we used the 1275 Super Skin last week, uh, and it was in a video. So you probably either have seen that or you should go watch it. Uh, it's just what you would expect. It's bigger. Glove flips are still fully possible because the softball is just so dang big. I don't think I want to use 12.75 in game. I'd either go 12 and a half or 12 and a quarter. I'll meet you guys back in the room. Okay, hey, so that went pretty smooth. We actually got more ground balls than I was thinking we would, so we were able to do it all in one game. Sadly, didn't get a ground ball with the A2K, but that's okay because I have a whole video on that already. Now, after I had used my 12 and a quarter, I really did like that one the best. And I still think that it feels the best when it comes to just moving back and forth, left to right. Whereas the 12 and a half right here just feels slightly slower, something that honestly might just mainly be mental. I'm not sure, but strictly comfort, I think I like 12 and a quarter the most. But when I think about it, because of how big a softball is, it's not gonna get stuck in the glove or anything like a baseball can. And so I can still make glove flips even with 12.75. So I really probably should be using 12 and a half or 12 and three quarters. I may go back to 12 and a quarter. Comfort is important. And I think it's a hard thing to weigh, but sometimes if you're more comfortable with a certain size, even if it's small or technically worse, comfort can make you play better in the end, so. I honestly don't think there's any reason to use a 12 inch glove unless it's just all you have. If you have a bigger option that's a decent glove, you should probably just be using it because there's no reason to just get a little bigger. I've noticed a lot of guys who would be considered, you know, professional softball players, they're using really big gloves, like 12.75, I'm pretty sure minimum. That probably says a lot. Um, you might as well just use a bigger glove if you can. Once again, subscribe if you aren't, you guys. I have an Instagram where I just post some behind the scenes kind of stuff. You just see a little bit more me in my life. So feel free, go check us out. I really do appreciate your view. And if you're watching all the way to the end, you're like my favorite person in the world. So good job. I haven't done this in a while.